do think, really want to encourage the multi tooling. I don't think it makes too much sense because I sh as a size two mining head, I should be able to at least be able to mine a higher max. Bro, that's that's my complaint, back. man. Doesn't make sense. Man. What's the point of making it a, a size up when it, there's no power difference? I, I don't get it. It may it's be a bigger, little but bit it's of a same power difference, but it's still hampered. As soon as we reach around 5,500 in mass, yeah, it's the same. The struggle is yeah. just like a prospector. Yeah. So that I was saying the other day, they just count it as, oh, you're supposed to have, it's, it's multi-crew. Have yeah. another person in there and you can crack whatever you want. Yeah. I mean, I don't know, man. I'm still... I still maybe they may change it in the future though. I think they may change it in the future because these are not even close to the size of rocks we'll be finding. Um, I don't. I'm good. You know. Hopefully by then the Orion will be out, and I won't even care. <laughs> <laughs> like an there. entire platform. <laughs> you don't even have to be selective. Well, according to the notes, you don't have to be selective. You just gobble up a whole asteroid. Yeah. And fill They're down making all want. sort or all sorts of ore, which you know, I don't smelting know. everything just right there, and I'm selling it. What's gonna be the penalty for that ship? Like fuel for consumption. Right? It's gotta be something. It's, it's probably gonna take true. a significant amount of fuel to even get to where it needs to get to, and then you'll le you'll got, literally need to bring. You'll le yeah, I feel like you'll need um, uh, what, what do you call time? it? Like it takes you triple the amount of time to gobble up rocks or something. Something has got it. There's got to be some kind of. Penalty. Yeah. Because if that's the case, everybody might as well just buy an Orion. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think. Um, the way I I view it, I think they will have it. It'll take a very significant amount of time for it to even get to a place, and it'll take a significant amount of time to actually chew up at least the rocks the size that they intend to do. Like, in some of the Squadron Forty Two um previews they showed i think an orion or something like that that was mining and it would like it'll be constantly trying to fracture it and it's, it you can see that it, it's going to take a while before it can even get through you know so i could see it sitting there for like months to chew up one large rock you know whoa, whoa, whoa. wait a minute now <laughs> i can see Don't that i'm serious like that. i can see it i can oh. see it yeah months like depending on the size of the rock i can see them doing that oh, well, because you talked about months and then in terms of in-game months versus like real life months i could uh, see them doing it in real life long. months as a as as an orion bro that's a platform that you don't really need to move right like you you sit it inside of an asteroid field like you stay there for months you know what i mean i can see that you know, so I mean, I feel like I feel like that's how they're gonna do it. That's that's my suspicion. You know, and it's supposed to be a org, an org run facility. You can't solo an Orion. You know, so we'll see. About that. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> I feel like that's you what they're gonna they're do. I feel like you're gonna need you're gonna need um what's what's the refueling ship? The Starlifter. Starlifter. You're gonna need multiple Starlifters to come in and out to refuel it. You're gonna need um, haulers to come and get whatever um, it's able to extract or whatever That's it's able raft. to smelt. The raft comes in. The raft, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You know, and and I could see it also being a platform where people, let's say other prospectors, let's say they go find Quantinium somewhere else, they'll bring it to a local Orion to smelt the Quantinium instead of going to a space station somewhere else. You know, so it'll literally be a station where it is. And you're going to need a lot of turret operators. Yeah, because, yeah, yeah. Because people are going to be, pirates are going to be like, oh, we just can't pass that, shooting exactly. that. Exactly. Well, you, hopefully, know. you know, we have a few Nautilus. Nautilus, exactly. Dispatch. Exactly. All of their sentries. Bro, it's, it's, I feel like it's going to open so many gameplay for other ships and other you know i think everybody's gonna be involved when it comes to an orion i feel you know i just um, don't see where their economy is going 
you say they're mm-hmm. going to be introducing a bunch of different new ores mm-hmm. and when you look at look at games like eve online okay everything you mine and you turn around and sell in the market somebody else buys to use to build modules or right. ships or right. player owned structures or whatever in the game right. so you, they have an a economy loop there right mm-hmm. uh but in this game that doesn't exist there is no manufacturing and crafting so, anything. Right. so i don't know how that's going i don't i don't think it's going to work but there is going to be manufacturing you know that right have salvaging so maybe along those lines that add some they i don't know if it was last citizen con um or the one before that but they explained that there will be uh manufacturing facilities you need to go to like refiners that you'll need to go to that actually produces i think they used it with the quantum example where there's actual refiners we uh, are taking ore refining and then actually producing products and um they showed the whole economy uh showcase so i could see that i don't know if all of it will be player based i think some of it will be npc based though but uh um, yeah, because it actually it actually creates demand and the mine goes out and then mm-hmm. if no normal players take it up npc right. players take it up and that spins off more missions to target them capture them so you mm-hmm. can take more help yeah yeah can't wait for that because that sounds like it's gonna be cool yeah 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 it, it, it was it was actually quite impressive i think it was the last citizen con before this after um before this one that just happened i think yeah tony tony um tell you what tony, man tony z right one thing i wouldn't mind doing in life is just sitting down mm-hmm. having a few scotches for that guy and just say ask a few questions his mind is just uh, incredible <laughs> he, how he thinks. Eh? He's, 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 he's just, a, he's, just phenomenal. How, just so you yeah. listen to him talk. Yeah. Is um, he's just like racing off in different directions, but then also in parallel. Like, right. it's, it's phenomenal. He definitely chosen the right guy to develop yeah. all that. I'm sure. Yeah. He's yeah, a, interesting guy. Yeah, he, he's a, he's such an art architect, man. I, Oh like mate, Log- logical ar- architecture, yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. yeah. This logic is, um, wow, yeah. <laughs> I, re- I remember, Kiwi, I remember the Odin, uh, back in the day when he would, like, I think Chris Roberts will intentionally be there with them when they do interviews to Random actually <laughs> <laughs> make sure he doesn't reveal too much information on what they're planning, right? So, like, that's how he is. He will literally break it all yeah, down but, for you right there, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. And I think Chris Roberts also, um, he's like the ideas, you know, and he needs to simplify mm-hmm. it down and don't just, you know, it, like, it's like anything you're dealing with engineers and programmers, their minds right. just, well, right, right. In right, my experience, right. yeah. So you got to have someone to, uh, I don't know, articulate what he's trying to say to the end user. Right, right. But, That's uh, true. I think, That's I think true. he did a good job explaining it. Yeah, I think so too. Pe- bro people love him man because he he will really break it oh, down for you phenomenal oh, i love, love yes. listening to him uh, yeah i can watch him usually things yes. put me to sleep but mate that guy there who needs coffee 